um, I thought this team got out to a great start. Uh, you know, great energy. Um, you know, and we just found ourselves with Illinois State climbing back in. Uh, we, we knew this game was going to be based on three things. Taking care of the ball, uh, boxing out, rebounding, and staying in the stands and keeping them off the free throw line. When you shoot 42%, you know, when you made more shots, this game ends up being won at the free throw line. And you gotta give credit to Illinois State. You know, they're upperclassmen, you know, they penetrate at us. Um, they did a great job of getting in the seams, getting to the free throw line. And when the clock, clock is stopped, that's when you're catching back up. So, you know, um, but, you know, I love the glimpses of what I see with this team. But we have <coughs> definitely got to learn how to finish a game we're truly in control of. And those are the things, those three areas, I do think that we are in control. We just got to be more consistent. I mean, the article said it had all, you know, right on today. Um, you know, I take these 20 losses and, uh, you know, I look at it as an opportunity, you know, 21, opportunity to continue to teach and, um, you know, challenge these guys to look at things, look at themselves, look at this team, our leaders, four leaders, you know, we're on the same page and we just keep teaching. But the positive that I've seen in them all is amazing. Uh, you know, I'm very, very proud of them. And even though it's not showing up in the win column, we are very talented. Uh, we have some great pieces. We'll continue to add to these pieces, obviously. But um, I, I'm very, very impressed uh, with what they have done and how they've continued to grow and grow. I think like my coach said, I think uh, Jaya and Brittany Martin did a great job, phenomenal, non, uh, phenomenal, had a phenomenal night tonight. Um, they really kept it going, uh, played great defense. Uh, you know, Brittany's a great defender. Jaya's a great offensive player and defender. So I really think they did a great job. Um, I was a little indecisive tonight. Uh, I just tried to come out there and, and give it my all. Um, even though I was in a little foul trouble, I still kept faith in my team. I know my team can do it without me. I've seen them do it without me and, and do some phenomenal things with me not even on the floor. So I do uh, believe in my team. And if my team needs me to be a cheerleader on the side, then that's what I'm going to do while I'm in my foul trouble. But I'm going to continue to encourage and, and motivate my teammates. Just like Coach said, we just need to be consistent in practice and do our roles and do what we're supposed to do every day. And I mean, to motivate them, that's the only thing that we can do. I will call it trying to run my team in the best way I can. And maybe I, maybe like some of the shots I did take were rushed and, and, and out of control. But you know, that's something that I have to learn to, to, uh, to control in practice. And, and when my team beside me <clears throat> and trusted me to take those shots, you know, I don't feel as a low because I feel that they trust me to, to to perform for them and uh, and and get get a score so we can get back on defense and play and get stops. So uh, I mean, it's it's not about scoring. It's really about health and and performance. Uh,